Bill the Pirate, and Mike the Chef. Take 200. Um, Pirate Bill and Chef Mike present five interactions in nature. Cue the music. Public Bill. Welcome back to PPBC, and today we're talking about a worldwide crisis, parasitism. First, the definition of parasitism is an interaction in which one animal, a parasite, lives on or inside another animal as a host and is harmful to it. Take this dog, for example. What? What? The dog is the host, and this flea is the parasite. The flea attaches itself to the dog and feeds on its blood. The flea benefits from this interaction, and the dog is harmed. And local hospitals and veterinarians just can't keep up with all of this madness. Oh, you a good one. Oh, you a you. That's right, folks. Fleas are taking over us by feeding inside of us. This is a big and horrible interaction with humans, ex animals too, of course. Alfred! We're, we're sorry, folks. Alfred seems to be out of, the, out of the room at the moment. But, hold on. Alfred! I'm here, oh. I'm here. I'm sorry, my beard's a little bit off. Okay, Whew. to help any of you listeners survive the plague, here is some information. First, use bug repellent to keep the parasites away. Like, not like this poor fellow. Parasites mostly get in my cuts, so protect them at all costs. I repeat, all costs. Make sure to check yourself after being in a wooded area and be care. They're here, run for your lives! Ah! <laughs> have a tiger shark swimming in the ocean he is searching for a tasty snack he is the predator shark shark okay, here sees a shadow of a seagull flying by he leaps out of the air Snack for the predator, but a sad day for his prey. Okay, now changing the subject. Now changing the subject, symbiosis, symbiosis has been happening a lot lately. Symbiosis is a close relationship between two species that benefits at least one of the species. The three types of symbiosis are commensalism, mutualism, and parasitism. We already told you about parasitism, so now we'll tell you about commensalism. Commensalism is a relationship where one species benefits, and the other is neither helped nor harmed. You have the tiny elf owl. 
No, wait, 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 whoa, 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 whoa. We need a cactus whoa, whoa, whoa. here. Where's we need a cactus, cactus here. Shh, shh. <clears throat> oh, cactus. Thank you. Here you have a tiny elf owl. The elf owl makes his home inside a cigar. Oh, cactus. The elf owl has the elf owl has somewhere to live, and it does not harm the cactus. The elf owl's interaction with the saguro cactus is an example of commensalism. Commensalism. Thank, thank you. Thank good, you. Thank good. you. Thank yeah. you. Yeah. 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 Okay. Bill, let's move on to another symbiotic relationship. Marvelous mutualism. What, what's so marvelous about it? Well, <coughs> it's pretty good. I mean, most things would be able to survive. Okay. Oh my God. Mutualism is a relationship where both species benefit. Hey, Chef Mike, time to use a cactus again. Yeah, that is one useful cactus. What on earth is that? It's a long-nosed bat. He's sipping nectar from that cigar o' cactus. That is interesting. Oh, I get it. Oh, I get it. It's the cigar o' cactus is also benefiting from the bat because the pollen is getting in the bat's nose. Another way of saying it, pollen boogers. Pretty much, yes. And the bat will fly away and pollinate another plant. That is really cool. Yes. Mutualism, it it's a win-win situation. situation. For a final interaction. For a final interaction. For our final interaction, we will report you on competition. Competition. Oh yeah, last year's winners was the lion by defeating the hyenas in an intense race to the gazelle. Oh yeah, I remember that in comp that intense competition. The excitement, the teamwork. It was amazing. Boy, did you even see the competition? Excuse me. Of course I was watching the competition. It's not like I was watching. Okay, never mind. Whoa, 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 whoa! Excuse me, but did you just say caca? <gasps> what? Okay, okay. I missed a competition because I was watching Cupcake Wars. <laughs> oh, <gasps> I'm so ashamed of you, bad boy, bad boy, bad boy. Oh. <laughs> anyway, sorry about that, guys. The competition is coming up in Animal Town, and man, they are hungry! Woo! Get the lion! King of the jungle! And the cheetah! So fast! They, they are examples of competition. They are competitors because they live together in the same, in a similar niche. <laughs> they compete with each other for food and space. Well, I wonder if the lion or cheetah would like a cupcake.
Well, that's a wrap, folks. Hope we, learned, oh yeah. we hope you learned a lot about these five interactions. <laughs> Thank you, and good night! High five. That was horrible. Fire, fuck, fire, fuck.